welcome back to the channel. So it's been a few weeks since my last video and it's also been the same amount of time so I've actually touched um, the Ford. So anyway, obviously today in this video we're doing the downpipes. Uh, they need to be welded up. So far I have one of them and we have the other one right here. So first I just need to double check inside this tube to make sure there's not going to be any uh, sugaring on the tacks because that doesn't go away when you weld it. And um, then I will start taping off all the seams for the purging. <laughs> step closer both down pipes are welded up and I think that's pretty much it for the stainless other than I need to figure out something for the uh, wastegate dumps and I think that's it and then we can start working on the intake which is all aluminum um, but for stainless I think that's pretty much it for now so I'm pretty happy with how everything's been turning out so far um, still a handful of things to do uh, I still got to make the um, supports for the, the turbos and the exhausts themselves. Um, I'm probably going to use some stainless rod for that. As far as the exhaust coming out the fender, everything's pretty, pretty close right now. There might need to be some uh, trimming on um, how far it sticks out. And I'm also going to get some beauty rings for that too, black. So that'll look pretty good when that's done. So along with counting things down, getting on the truck, we're also counting down the days and months until we can um, take this thing out, until it's springtime, some nice weather coming up. Uh, so far it hasn't been bad the last few weeks. It's about 40s right now for us in Michigan. So that's not too bad. So we're getting there. All right guys, so that's gonna be it for this part of the project, seeing as how I don't have the materials for the turbo supports the turbo hangers, whatever you want to call them, um, and the exhaust supports at the bottom, uh, somewhere in there. So I'm going to try and get those ordered up today and have them soon. So as soon as I get those, I can really start wrapping up the, the hot side, the exhaust side of the turbos and get that squared away. So getting these turbos wrapped up will be really nice because there is still a whole lot to do before springtime. 
Um, I don't even know if I'm going to get the cage in before I drive it for the first time, which is not a big deal, but I should have that soon in after the first drive though. So with that being said, I'm really hoping to ramp up the video content um, here shortly, just with all the, the other things starting to slow down and with all the stuff I need to get done on the truck, that's definitely the goal. Also to start chipping away at the uh, pole barn addition and maybe some other work to do in the barn to just make it nicer insulation, stuff like that. But that is going to be it for this video. Thank you for watching and we will see you next time. Thanks.